What's going on awesome people of YouTube? In today's video, I wanna show you how you can go and copy and paste these Spotify or Apple Music style t-shirts where they have these songs on them with this audio style and the play and skip button to make anywhere between 100 and $600 a day. There are people that are making hundreds of thousands of dollars with this every single year catching onto this trend. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can start off completely for free. You don't need to buy any of these t-shirts yourself. You can go and design them online, sell them online. The company will make the t-shirt for you. They do all the shipping and deliveries and you just keep the markup as the man in the middle. It's such a viral underground easy way to actually make money online with this trend right now. And I'm going to show you how you can capitalize on it. Before we get started, I want you to go down below to the bottom of this video, look for the subscribe button, hit it and put that notification bell on so that I can send you a personal message every time I upload an epic video just like this one. Also, make sure to leave a like, comment down below and on the pinned comments, I will leave a link to a thousand dollar giveaway for Christmas that I'm going to be having this year. So make sure to go and do those three things down below so that you can go and get your link. And also go and follow me on Instagram over here. You can receive some epic podcast content from me where I talk about money tips and all sorts of different topics. Topics. You can also send me a message and see a little bit into my personal life. But without further ado, we're going to continue straight with this video. Like I said, guys, I want to show you how these Spotify and Apple Music style music t-shirts are absolutely selling crazy. I mean, take a look at this person over here selling this shirt for $10.20. They are basically getting... 30, between 20 and 30% commission on the sale because remember Etsy.com here, which is a worldwide free website where you can go and sell your merchandise, create your merchandise, and they automatically generate all these t-shirts, these caps, these hooders, even phone covers and jewelry with all your logos and brands that you have created. They manufacture it for you, ship and deliver it for you. That's why they keep the majority of the markup. But I mean, if you take this company over here, let's go and actually calculate what they've earned. They've generated over here $10.20 multiplied by 13,099 sales of here. So let's go $10.20. That's over $133,000 this t-shirt has made. But remember, they only take about 20% of this. So let's multiply this by 20%. That means they have made $26,721.96 on this little t-shirt trend over here. They didn't invest any capital into this. This is all profit over here because remember, because remember a lot of the traffic is naturally generated from Etsy.com and Etsy also has partnership with Amazon, eBay, where you can plug in your store to all of Amazon and eBay's traffic as well, which I'm going to show you how to set up. So step number one, guys, is going to come over to Etsy.com over here, which is a website where you can go and sell all sorts of products such as wedding and party, home and living, clothing and shoes, jewelry and accessory, Christmas sales as well, arts and collectibles, craft supplies. So this website is mostly in the fashion niche over here. And I mean, some of the trends that are selling right now absolutely blow up. And I mean, people make a killing within days, even minutes, their stores start to get sales. I mean, this person over here who's quite a newbie sells his t-shirt for $20. They've already got 266 so, uh, sales over here, which is well over four figures, even close to five figures, just on a basic t-shirt like this over here that took them two minutes to design. And they literally copy and paste all the t-shirts into multiple colors, multiple sizes. So it's suitable from kids all the way up to adults to buy this product. And another website that I recommend you guys go and write down or take notes of if you want to get into the strategy to make money copying these images on your t-shirts and catching onto these trends over here is merch.amazon.com. This is another website where you can go and list your t-shirts. Obviously, we know Amazon is one of the biggest companies in the world. There's a lot of traffic coming to this website every single day. We can catch onto that trend with these custom song t-shirts over here with these Spotify and Apple Music over here. We can also go and use redbubble.com. So the more places you go and list your t-shirts and remember these websites are going to design these stores for you. That means more sales for you and your store and more revenue for you. Guys, and if you think about these t-shirts over here, um, take a look at the names of the songs. They are a billion songs in here in today's world on Spotify and Apple Music that you can go and put these t-shirts on. You can go and use Justin Bieber songs. You can go and use Ariana Grande music. You can go and use any song right now, especially if there's new songs that are coming out that are becoming trends. You can go and sell them as t-shirt merch and you can actually make a lot of money from that. And in order to go and create our t-shirts, guys, we're going to be using a tool called Canva.com. Now, this tool can honestly, and has made me a lot of money in the past with various graphic design um, post Instagram posts, viral YouTube shorts, viral TikToks that I've generated and created with Canva. This website is the 
the number one recommended graphic design tool online to go and make money with. So what we're gonna go and do is we're actually gonna go and create a custom design and I'm going to explain to you why. So on the top right, click on create a custom design and you wanna click on custom size over here and you want to enter the following with 2400 by 3200 over here simply because this is a very big canvas that is a very HD version because when you upload this picture to your t-shirt it obviously needs to be a crystal clear quality when they print the t-shirts it can't be a bad blurry quality otherwise the t-shirt is going to look not great at all and people are not going to rate you so it's super important that you use this custom width and height over here click on create new design it will open up a brand new blank canvas for you guys in canvas design tool and what i recommend you do is before you go and design this you want to create two copies of your t-shirt design simply because you want to have over here if i scroll up back to the top you want to have a version that is white with white text and then you want to have another version for a white t-shirt where the text needs to be black so that people can read it first thing i'm going to do is I'm going to come over to Google Images and search for a song play bar over here. And over here, I found the Shopify uh, song bar. So what we can do is we can actually go and click on this white template over here. Go and open this in a new tab and save this as a template. So I just created a new folder on my PC and I'm now going to save this onto my PC. You just click right click save so it saves to your PC. Come over to your Canva canvas over here. You want to click on uploads, upload media, open that file and upload this play bar. And all you want to do is, is just kind of drag it to the middle of the section over here. You'll see the two lines will highlight we can make actually make this a little bit bigger and we want to drag this to the center so it fits perfectly like that so there we go we've got our first template made over here obviously what we need to go and do is we need to go and get the song name maybe like a little heart and the little uh, spotify soundbar over here so we can go and search for on google viral or let's go trending songs right now obviously because we want to go and catch trends so let's go go trending songs click on enter over here here you can see right now Skate by Bruno Mars. Let's open up the top tracks in 2021 on Spotify over here. Um, here you can see right now it's Skate by Bruno Mars, Rumors by Lizzo and Cardi B, Stay with the Kid Leroy. So what we can go and do is we can keep this list open here. We can open up our Canva template over here. You want to go and add some text. Let's just add some a subheading over here. We can drag this above this play bar. And we can type here Stay. We can maybe put this in bold text. So let's just click on bold. And we kind of just want to line this up in the corner with this play bar. Then underneath this, we want to add another subheading, but that's in normal text mode. And we want to make this a little bit smaller. It fits like that. Put it underneath the name of the song. And we can type here, The Kid Leroy. And what we want to do is we just want to add a little small text over here. And we want to type the total length of the song. So this song is a total of three minutes, uh, two minutes, 21. So we just can type here, two colon 21. Uh, 21 and we can drag this to the end of the song over here we can actually make this a little bit smaller if you want just make sure it's at the end and you can then go and copy and paste this and over here under the, the where the dot is we can make this for example like 0 23 like that and there we go now what we can go and do is we want maybe just want to get a let's just go search here Spotify heart where the people can like the song so let's click on images over here um, here you can see is the black Spotify heart when people like a song that it highlights black. So we can go and open this in a new tab over here. Just go click on this image um, over here. There will be a free download button over here. Download PNG for free. Give it a couple of seconds and your download will start shortly. Once this is downloaded to your PC, this will save over here in the new folder. What you want to do is come back to Canva over here and you want to go and upload media again. Upload media and go and upload this little heart image. And we can click on it over here. Just make it a bit smaller and you want to put it in the corner in line with the text over here. It's important that everything lines up because remember everything needs to line up perfectly on the t-shirt that you're going to sell. One more thing we can go and do is we can come over to Google. I'm just going to close these tabs over here. Come over to Google and go and search Spotify soundbar over here. Click on enter and here we can click on this soundbar over here. Yeah, they've got a white template. So we're going to open up this black template first, save this to your PC. And then you want to go and open up this white one as well, obviously for the uh, white t-shirt, because obviously white text on a white t-shirt, you're not going to see anything. So let's open this in a new tab and we can save this to our PC. Then come back to Canva over here. We're just going to go and upload this media again. We're going to upload this white one and just wait for this to upload. We can then click on this. And then what you want to do is, uh, I think we just need to crop this a little bit. So let's just quickly go and crop this image. This image is too big. So you just want to right click on the image, click on edit. It'll open it up with paint over here and just go and crop this image 
by select all rectangular selection and just make it that little bit smaller. Then we can then click on save or file save over here. And you want to come back to Canva over here and just upload this new copy. So just re-upload that. There we go. So now we can click on this and that is much better. We can actually increase the size a bit. And there we go. This is actually looking really good for a t-shirt design. Comment down below what you think. I mean, I literally made this in two minutes on Canva. Comment down below if you think this will sell or if you think people will like it. But right now you can see something like this is a massive trend. And it took me three minutes to make this on Canva.com completely for free. And then all we want to go and do is once we're ready, we can click on download over here. We can download this as a PNG copy. And this is now this new copy is saved to our PC. And now we need to go and put this on our t-shirts. So let's go and use redbubble.com over here as a good example. What we're going to do is we're going to click on sell your art on the top right over here. Um, you also it will probably take you to the sign up page first if you haven't got an account click on start selling on this page over here and you want to click on artist sign up where you can set up your own shop and start selling your designs sign up with your own account with your email username and password once you're logged in with your account click on your profile icon on the top right over here click on sell your art and we want to go and click on create products add designs over here you want to click on upload new work and you want to go and select this picture that we created on Canva. And remember the picture is already the correct resolution, the HD resolution because of that size that we selected on Canva.com. So on Redbubble over here, we can create our title. So for a title, we can literally go and get an example. We can type here custom stay by the kid Leroy Spotify. We can type here favorite song shirt we can type here trending song shirt and and for the tags we can type here the kid leroy merch we can type here stay by the kid leroy trending music shirt just gonna add a couple of t uh, tags so that the algorithm knows what audience to show your t-shirt to. So obviously people, when people search trending music search, your product is going to pop up. For the description, you want to add a description like this where people can add their own personalization so where they can enter the song title, name of the artist you want on the shirt. So for example, if they want a different song, then all you do is you come over to your Canva template and you just change this text to the song that they would like. Um, and that's, you will leave a field over here. So we're gonna copy that as our description, come back to Redbubble and we can paste this over here. And I mean, take a look at what this shop has already created for you. They've created an entire Kid Leroy cap, a t-shirt, a like a vest, a little dress, stickers and magnets, phone covers even, um, which you can all go and edit so you can resize this completely. So let's go click apply changes. We can make this a bit smaller to fit on the cover. So each and every one of your um, products you can actually go and resize so if you see something is off like look at this cap you just click on edit then all you do is over here you just scale the image a little bit smaller so that it fits onto the cap and you can also just have a look at everything and just make sure everything fits onto your products over here so yeah you can see like these mugs obviously need to be resized I would say something like like that and then we just move this to the middle so it does fit we can make it a little bit bigger See, now that fits perfectly. So you just want to resize everything and make sure it fits. You also got a tablet case over here. So just resize everything and make sure that it does fit. Because obviously, if a customer buys something from you, you don't want them to have defaults or like text missing or something like that because then they're going to want a return. So over here, what we can do is we can then click on a color over here if you want to. You can have a look at the different colors. But I recommend leave the color at the default white that it already is. And once you're ready, you can scroll down all the way to the bottom. You can see you even get your own masks over here. That's absolutely crazy. Um, you can also add some photography, digital paintwork, drawing, digital art of all of this as well. Once you're done and resized everything to fit perfectly on each and every product, click on save work over here. Uh, just select no for this is this mature content. Then click on I have the right to sell this product and click on saved work over here. And then it will process your teas and all your products over here on your own store. And take a look at this over here. You can see is my cap over here. They can select their own size delivery already set to my country over here. You can leave reviews. And I mean, this is selling for $23. You're going to get 20% of the sale. So I mean, over here, if I come back to 
red bubble over here, you can see everything is already made on your store. Some of these pictures are just still loading up. But once you're ready, you can view your entire store over here. Yeah, you can see is the shop to your entire store where people can go and buy all of your products. And you wanna take this link to your store over here and you can go and start promoting this everywhere. The potential with this is absolutely to the moon and back. You can go and share the store on a couple of Facebook groups with your friends on Instagram. Go and start an Instagram theme shop. If you've got a TikTok page with a bit of an audience, you can even order one of these t-shirts yourself, make a couple of TikToks in them and recommend link in bio to this t-shirt to go and buy your own merch. Uh, if you've got a YouTube channel, a Facebook, Facebook group page, a Twitter page, a Quora blog, Pinterest page, you name it, you wanna go and promote this everywhere possible. As soon as you build up a bit of capital in your business, you can then scale with Facebook ads or Google ads or YouTube ads, scaling your t-shirt brand all over the internet. And remember, you can do this with multiple songs. Well, like I showed you, you can actually tell people to email you with your order number to have their own custom song name on, which is also pretty cool. So people can enter their own song name. And that I think is something really unique as well, is people making their own custom shirts like this with their own song that they want. So that's a great idea. And you can actually go and make a lot of money copying and pasting these images all over your merch. And like I show you, people are making over thousands, hundreds of thousands of dollars every single year from selling merch like this. But what I'll do guys to help you up more with promoting your store, with ads, with just overall getting traffic to this. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to leave my affiliate marketing playlist over here. I know this is not affiliate marketing, but in my affiliate marketing playlist, I talk about hundreds of different traffic methods that you can actually apply with your store. So it's also important that you sometimes think out of the box. So go and click on this playlist over here. It will help you with tons of traffic and I'll see you over there.